And to honor Women's History Month, every Tuesday we are giving a spotlight to a remarkable local woman who has given back to her community. Eyewitness News reporter Jessica Landman has that story. Our remarkable woman this week is Deborah Kaufman. Since returning to the area after spending years pursuing her goals in Texas, she has certainly made an impact on the community of Little Falls. Not only did she start the newspaper there, but she also created her own internship program for students recently graduated from high school called Creative Outpost. We were getting a lot of uh, contracts from different people who knew of our reputation, wanted us to work on one thing or another, uh, and lately we've been doing a lot of live streaming, and we put, you know, a very expensive camera in our interns' hands, and they're usually 16, 17, you know, up to probably 19, 20 years old. Uh, they're the, the people who we trust the most with cameras. They do play-by-play. -play. They do all kinds of interesting things for sporting events. Um, but it's really worked out great. Uh, we took the approach one person at a time. If we could get one person motivated and inspired to go on into media as a career, that we would be hitting a home run. This, however, is not the only mark that Kaufman will leave in her community. She is also making history as the first female mayor of Little Falls. I never considered myself tremendously political one way or another. I always thought of solving problems. And that's why I decided to throw my hat in the ring was to solve problems. And oh, by the way, then you're thrown into all this political debate as well, right? And so some of it can be pretty challenging, pretty tough. You gotta have some thick skin. Um, but it's also you find people who think like you do and embrace what you're wanting to do, and there's nothing better than that. Although it may not seem like a big deal to her, it is having a positive impact on all the little girls in the area that now look up to her. Um, I never really considered that um, a, a great attribute to be male or female. You know, to me it's just, can you do a job? Can you do a good job? And who are you as a person and should people trust you? and uh, you know, want to put their faith in the future in your hands, and it's quite a responsibility. But also, you know, when I really noticed uh, about being the first female, when it really became fun for me, my niece